In the Alabama legislature, a bill that would ban transgender teens from playing sports is a step closer to becoming law. WKRG News 5 State Capitol reporter Jeff Sanders is covering the story tonight in Montgomery. The bill passed the Senate by a vote of 25 to 5, but only after strong opposition from Democrats. The legislation, according to its language, is designed to prevent a biological male from participating on a female team in grades K through 12. Republican Senator Garland Gudger of Coleman pushed the bill in the Senate. It already had passed in the House. He maintains it's not an anti trans bill, but instead a women's rights bill. About women's safety and athletics, and period. And so if I had a daughter, um, I would want to make sure that she was on a fair playing ground with other women that she was playing against, and this bill addresses that only. But Senate Democrats say the bill discriminates against transgender youth. Plus, they say it could hurt the state's economy if big business decides the state is no longer where they want to call home. Why we give ourselves this black eye in Alabama just to have a, a newsprint tomorrow? It'll flash up there. And then when you start saying Google and Apple and everybody else starts saying that they're going to leave the state of Alabama. The bill now heads back to the House to iron out any differences between the Senate and House versions. From there, it goes to the governor for her signature. Reporting from the State House in Montgomery, Jeff Sanders, WKRG News 5.